Petita potentially inflated stocks are two matters you will continue to hear throughout this year, if you haven't already. In August, the Signal reported that Petit donated stock to the university at a potentially inflated value. According to the report, Petit donated 325,000 shares, totaling close to $5 million. Petit's former pharmaceutical company, Mumedix, which removed Petit from its board of directors over the summer, is now under at least four federal investigations. There's a possibility that Mumedix could attempt to recoup Petit's donations made to the Georgia State University Foundation, according to the Signal. So why bring this issue up again? When Petit pledged to donate $10 million to Georgia State in 2017, this resulted in the naming of the football field in the new stadium, which means Petit Field is a tangible reminder of the ongoing controversy. Georgia State students, the avid supporter of the Panther football team, are not readily aware of Petit's potentially fraudulent affair. However, the allegations facing Petit have been largely under-discussed in the athletic department. Yet, as the Panthers play on a football field with Petit's name this season, the situation facing the university is growing unavoidable. Only the Board of Regents at the University System of Georgia can approve the renaming of a USG university building. There is no timetable on the university to remove Petit's name. How the school continues to manage such a developing situation as continued report surface will be closely watched by the signal. I'm Jarrell Russian, and this has been another update on the Petit T. Make sure to follow us for any more updates on this matter, and more is coming to you soon. Thank you for watching. Until next time.